What's going on guys? It's Chris Brew Reviewer here, it's Chris, and today I have a case review. Um, my first one in a while, so I'm just going to hop right into, the, right into this. This is a review on the uh, Incipio right here, still acrylic, for the iPod Touch 2G. Um, I'm not going to go through the whole packaging, just going to tell you what it comes with. It, you get the uh, surface protector, the screen protector right there. You get a cleaning cloth, microfiber, which is right in there. It's a pretty nice one. And a, uh, a video stand, which is pretty uh, nice, I guess, if you actually use those. Um, on the back, just gives you a little description all that. And then, basically, the views of the case. Um, pick this one up at, I think it's mindscipio.com, something like that. Or, I picked this one up at my gear store for like twenty four dollars or twenty dollars something like that um so basically here's the case right here it says in Scipio uh, this is a two-piece case so you see the two pieces right here both parts say in Scipio um, basically if you don't know what this case is about it's called the silicrylic so basically it's silicone half silicone half uh, acrylic or uh, I don't really know but it's half silicone and half plastic or uh, hard material whatever um, the silicone is very nice silicone um, around the edges where this plastic does not connect to is very uh, pretty thick nice protective uh, not too grippy not really a link catcher uh, and pretty nice just feels pretty nice um, it's pretty flexible you see it here it's scrunched up into a, blow, a ball it's pretty good um, you do have these little let me, hold on, let me see something. Is that better with the light? Yeah, I'll leave the light on. Uh, you do have these little rises right here where this piece connects into it like that. So, uh, I'm just going to throw my iPod in real quick just to start this off. Just get it in there like that. Line up all your buttons and all that good stuff. And there you have it. You have your case. You see here, and Scipio does that thing where it sort of dips down around the home button. And then you got nice cutouts for your SIN cable and uh, your headphone jack and your volume rockers are nicely, very nicely cut out here and as well with your uh, home or uh, sleep awake button. Megan Fox. Um, so basically that's the silicone uh, half right there. Very form fitting, very nice and uh, very nice feel in your hand. It catches minor lint on the top here and on the sides but this silicone doesn't catch the lint. It's mostly, mostly just this uh, outer thicker side um, going around the edges looks pretty nice covers up all mostly all the way up to the black up to the black alright sorry about that um, so yeah this covers basically all the way up to the black you can see there I'll zoom in a tiny bit you gotta pull it back a pretty good amount to get it back to the uh, chrome bezel for your iPod see it on the corners and everything so now I'll head into the um, plastic section or half of this case you can see right here it's got a little uh, spine type look just lays it in like this I'll show you how to attach it you just gotta line up the first two like this if you do it like one corner at a time like how I used to try to do it you put in the one corner and then try and put it in the other corner it doesn't really work too well because then the other side will pop off what you have to do is sort of line them both up like this you can see it line them both up so that they look like they're going to go in even and then just push them both in at the same time and they should go over nice and easy with a little adjustment so you see it there both top corners are nice and even and then the bottom just you can do one at a time for that and there you have it you got your case on nice and uh, form fitting very hard plastic you can hear that and then nice uh, bouncy smooth soft silicone around the edges um, so with this case, you are getting a very high quality and amount of protection from this. You are getting the nice, uh, silicone drop protection that is very nice. And you're also getting the nice, um, plastic scratch protection and all that, which is very, very good. Um, you can see sort of in the light, it's taking some scratches on the plastic. You can see it a little right there. So it is serving its purpose as a, uh, protective case. Um... A few things, not really big deal. Like I said, a little bit of lint catches up here on the sides and all that. Um, one little thing, you 
might not even be able to notice on camera because it's such a small thing, but just where the volume rockers are, it seems like it sort of bows out a little bit and doesn't stay straight. Like, I don't know. I just think, I just feel like it sort of bows out like this too much, where this side seems pretty straight the whole way, and this side, it sort of seems like where, once you get to the volume rocker, it sort of bows out. I don't know. In person, it looks like a more of a big deal. And then one more little thing. For some reason, this bottom right corner, you can see it pretty well there. This plastic part doesn't actually end up coming all the way over. I don't know why. Um, every other corner comes up nice and uh, even and tight with the silicone. So, I mean, every corner is good. It's just once you get to this bottom right-hand corner, whatever corner you put on last basically ends up like this. You can see the gap there. It doesn't actually wrap all the way around. I don't know why that happens. Um kind of a downer. I like having my cases perfect and neat and uh, well put together and when there's just little things like that that aren't perfect about the case it sort of just makes me not want to use it I guess. Um, the bottom sags just a tiny bit. You see it there. It's not really a big deal. But it does. Uh, if you're really sort of like me and don't like your cases to be completely perfect then uh, just gotta keep an eye out for that just in case. Um, so that's basically it guys for this one. A very nice protective case. You're getting a very nice style. It looks very cool with the uh, spine going along the back and all that. And if you actually picked up a different color, you could switch swap, switch, I don't even know what I was trying to say. You could switch the colors back and forth to get some nice color combinations, sort of like the Rebel that the Switch Easy has going on. So this is a very, very nice uh, protective case with a nice style along with it as well. You're getting great protection, I'm telling you guys, great protection with this one. So if you do end up picking this one up, you will not be disappointed at all. Very, very, um, just form-fitting. I mean, it really does curve with your iPod. You can see it there. It feels nice in the hand, all that good stuff. So, I mean, yeah, you might, I'm, I'm going to recommend it. Go check it out. Black on black isn't really the um, most, uh, I guess, popping color. It's sort of dull and boring. I should have gone with a different color, so I mean, if you are looking to pick this one up, get a cool color. I mean, they have a blue, they have a yellow, they have an orange, they have a white, but uh, if you aren't looking for anything flashy, then just pick up the black, but I feel like it's kind of dull, and I wish I would have gotten a different color. Um, guys, that's basically it for today. I just wanted to say, follow me on Twitter. You can see my name right there. Actually, no, you can't. Turn the light off. Can you see it? Screen's too bright. Never mind. But uh, follow me on Twitter, guys. The name's Crispy Reviewer. Uh, I'll have a link in the sidebar. I, I uh, post some stuff up there, some updates, all that good stuff. So follow me on that, guys. Thanks so much for subscribing. Thanks for watching. Five stars, I'd really appreciate. And if you're not already, the yellow subscribe button on the other side. I would really appreciate if you guys would uh, check that out and check out my channel page. Um, next video is going to be a giveaway video. I'm still deciding between uh, what case to give away. But it will be a giveaway, so stay tuned for that. Probably, maybe Friday night, maybe Saturday night. So keep an eye out for that one, guys, and uh, have a good one, alright? Peace.